Fed in. Do, 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 And I hope you all enjoy watching the rest of TennoCon 2022. Bye. Bye. Hey, everybody. Megan here to let you know Hi, that by watching this year's show on Twitch, you're going to earn yourself some incredible free items if you have your Warframe and Twitch account link. I'm eating some of these watching shortbread TennoCon cookies. Until 5 p.m. Eastern time for 30 consecutive minutes will reward you with both the Bear Chris Warfan and the Rinala Sugatra. But that's not all. Tune into Tenno Live between 5 p.m. and 7 p.m. Eastern Time for another 30 consecutive minutes, and you're going to earn yourself a free Titania Prime. That's right, a free Prime Warframe. Cool. And, sh and that's one of the ones Twitch that flies around. If you your Warframe account linked and received drops before on Warframe streams, then you're all set. But if you've never linked your Warframe and Twitch account together, simply go on over to warframe.com slash twitch, log into your Warframe account, and follow the simple instructions to get set up. And that's it. Enjoy the show. What? Hello. Hi. Hi. How's it going? You're a Sanskate floof. What? I'm a Bolarola. Okay. You, re you really are. I'm okay with this. If you're okay with this, if you um, want to talk you about have some things. Four legs, and I've got flippers. Yeah. So, um, maybe not. But maybe if Chat buys enough stuff on the Warframe store, we'll be able to turn back. Maybe. Did you know that we have Tenocon merch? What? Yeah. When did this come out? It this morning. But it's not the morning anymore. Is it still there? We've got a wake up Tenno mug. Oh my god, I hope it's still there. Cause like, how am I gonna know how to wake up if I don't have a mug that tells okay. me how to wake up? Don't panic, don't panic. Okay. We've, we've got a Warframe lamp. Maybe that's still there. I love lamp. We've got, uh, yeah, Mesa t-shirts. We've okay. got a Neja Wukong t-shirt, a Rhino t-shirt. What does that even mean? Shirt. You yeah, like t-shirts? You really We do. got t-shirts. <laughs> TennoCon merch pack, you can still buy it. If you want to yeah. celebrate TennoCon and you want to have a creepy mask on your chest. Yeah. In game, you get like a cool little charm and stuff. There's so much that's in it. We've got an Excalibur bobblehead. Hell yeah. A Sunny Popper floof. A Teshin statue. I love Teshin. He is really cool. He's got two swords, which like, considering I have no hands, that's more swords than I can hold. You I know what? It's worth it. For the amazing merch yes. that you will be able to buy possibly i'm not sure i'll be honest with you it's still june <laughs> um so when you're seeing this you're in the future and if stuff is sold out it's not my fault no and uh yeah so you could go check out all of our merch for TennoCon, and i'm gonna try and figure out a way to not be a bull roll anymore cool Bye. dude all dressed <laughs> is salt and Welcome vinegar ketchup and barbecue we're getting so much closer to unveiling some incredible surprises. Tonight at 5 bad. p.m. Eastern Time, we'll be opening up the Duveri Amphitheater Orbiting Earth in-game. Join your fellow Tano for an up-close and very unique experience during the Tano Live presentation. As a special thank you for joining us for TennoCon today, Messages for the next 48 e hours, you can claim a special operator and drifter cosmetic, the Stranger's Hood. This exclusive cosmetic is available right now Where is on all it? platforms in the in-game market for one credit. Oh, Be sure oh. to log in and claim yours. Bye, Tenno. Ooh. The movement is so crazy in this game, man. I'm a fish from Deimos. Like a brown? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm like a Nissus at base. What happened? Ooh, that's a lot. <laughs> oh, no, it's going. It's going. It's going. Hold on, wait, it was going. Hello, everyone, and welcome to All Stars Warframe, a friendly competition of Warframe's greatest challenges. Fashion, interior decoration, budget cosplays, and of course, combat. My name is Earl T. Kim, Good also known as Earl of Sandwich. Your host for today. Okay. Um, Ordis has received messages for the operator. Where do no, I go to it? I have not read them. Um... Back out to the console and re-enter. Oh, 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 oh. Pa! Cool. Great. Thank you. The ice.
ice cold sort of vibe. I think it wet because she's cozy in the cottage in the forest. Oh, yep. Yeah. Let's get some burgundy. We're going to change oh. that white to something else. Okay. I like that she's got the bow too. Very nomadic. Oh, yeah. Energy, I don't even feel like I need to touch that. Ooh, that's a look. <laughs> Once you've got your selection, start making your way to get your selfie shots. Where are we going to go? Going to go to Jameis. Let's go, go, go. It's going to be a nice and cozy spot. There better Outside. be a tree. Tactical snow mission. You're in the mountains. Let's go. Pose. Pose. We got five seconds. Right up on the cliff here. Pose for it. Yes, yes. Go. Work Funny. it. Oh. Boom. Are we good with that shot? Tacked to cold oh. as ice. All right, chat. Which team was a 10 and which team was a no? Poll is live. Oh, that is the final score. Congratulations, Embers, to Ashes. I feel like that went really well. We're going to be getting into a little bit of gameplay. Okay, let's go. We're going in. The goal here is for me to do the headshots. Charlazar to just go ham. Just blow it all up. Mm -hmm. mm. Back up, back up, back up, back up. We are crushing it. You right? see an enemy, just cut through him. What's going on? So I initially thought my four went through the bubble, but I don't. My bitrate seems super low for some reason. Where am I going? Is y'all good? Oh man, where'd you go, laddie? I lost you. Hey, Goldie, what's up, buddy? <laughs> to the green, to the green. Hey, Dub Live, how are you? Yes, get there, get there. Which way did you go? Oh, another beefy. Oh, got God. a minute and a half left. Let's get those final kills in. Oh, we got it. Oh, we got it. Get Where? back, get back, get back. Get out, get out, get out, get out. You're making space, oh, Mom. Nervous. Oh, Ten seconds five. left. Ten seconds. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Come on, come on! Plenty of room for everyone. Oh, my chip! Yo, what is going on right now? Is this Tenocon? Vacation. <laughs> All right, poll is closed. Beach vacation it is. <laughs> I want to make sure I'm not missing anything. No, we need to get our colors. Oh, it gone. starts in like 10 I'm minutes. Okay, cool. Yellow. I'll throw Great. some lighter green in here to kind of give like the plant aesthetic. Maybe yeah. like some lime palm trees. I also want to start with the sand, but on the sides, we're going to go with the blue. Let's get the ocean water in here. Ooh, yeah. I'm liking this as a base. Decoration. Do we have any okay. decorations? If you had some beach balls, that'd be perfect for this. Oh, I'll get a planter right here, though. I'm going to get a couple of these, probably. Hold Take on. my shoulder. <gasps> what is that? Those are the little jellyfish. Let's get our beach towel laid out. You see it? Okay. This is where we hang out. Look at that. Ooh, hold up. 40 seconds. Oh, here we go. No, we got a tree up here, almost like a palm tree. <laughs> all right, let's get ready to take that photo now. I'm liking it. We got all the crabs. We got a couple of jellyfish right there. Oh, I love that. Dude, can I lay down? I can't lay down, but you know what? We can sit. We're on the Perfection. beach. Gorgeous, Come on. gorgeous. Woo! If that ain't beach vacation, okay. I don't know what is. This is the final tally, so I believe the victors are Embers to Ashes. First place. I clearly need another drink. One second. Okay, real quick. I'm hearing that the leaderboard is. What is Tenocon? Tenocon is the yearly event where they generally have big announcements for the game Warframe, which is a game that I have over 400 hours in. Uh, Warframe is a free to play game. It is mostly a farming game, but uh, what I, what me and a lot of players do is they spend generally a few hundred hours farming, or in some cases, thousands. But. If you're like me, you get to a point where eventually you're just kind of playing for the story and the big events and the set pieces. It's a really cool sci-fi game that is free to play, um, but it, it is a lot of fun, very unique, especially with how fast it is and very enjoyable. So we're doing a sponsor stream today. We're watching this year's Tenocon. They're probably gonna announce some like big new like quest stuff, which is the stuff that I'm really interested in. And um, yeah, these are always fun events. They're they're very much like, they're they're big, pomp and circumstance kind of shows, so they're fun. Yes, so I saw someone talking about it in chat. Here, here's how the game works. The game is free to play, but you can buy 
Warframes instead of farm for them. You can also buy some like uh, cosmetics and things of that nature. You can buy weapons instead of having to cook them. Um, there are the the mechanics are slightly mobily. Um, in in some people would probably call them kind of pay to win mechanics. Um, you can trade the currency you can buy though. So if you want to like farm your own stuff and then sell that for the in-game currency and then buy your own mechs and weapons, you can do that. Um, but it is a free to play game. So that's how they make their money. And um, you can farm for everything if you want to, but it will take literally hundreds and hundreds of hours where you can just put down a credit card and just buy them if you want to. So thankfully the game is fun. It's a fun game. So, you know, if you enjoy playing the game, you'll probably enjoy farming for most of the stuff anyway. So yeah, there's no loot boxes or anything like that. Oh, it's also mostly single player and co-op. So you're not talking about like, you know, it's not pay to win in the aspect where you're paying to be stronger than other people. It's, it's, I, I play pretty much all solo. And it's fine. Oh, hello and welcome. That was a sick intro, Dean. That's cool. Mm -hmm. Hello and welcome to Tenno Live, the end keynote of Tenocon 2022, which means we've Wee! made it through the day. Woo! Any bruises? Nope. Just some sunburns. <laughs> Any sunburns? No. 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 Anyone radiating heat at a level that's... This is embarrassing, though. No one showed up. I know. No one showed up. Yeah. This is real sad. Where's everybody? Uh, we were going to have the DE staff here to have like a pseudo live audience thing. Mm. We made it work. This is... um. Luckily, we were able to get a nice stage put it's together. Cool. The event team this. made this feel, awesome. Yeah. This is awesome. Yeah. So we're bad is just us getting I know. This is, it. It's quite uh, empty, but uh, <laughs> yeah. you're here. Twitch There's chat. like six people. Hey. You too. Thanks for being here. If you're watching, welcome. And thank you very much for joining. We we have about an hour of Warframe to talk about here. So we're gonna do some intro, some housekeeping, just saying hi. Uh, I love housekeeping, it's the best. Mm -hmm. <laughs> do you? <laughs> yes. That's, That's my favorite part of everything. <laughs> Scott's Damn. got a beer, okay. I don't. We're already oh. off to an yep. uh, unfair yeah. start. With have a spirit me. animal. Where's my beer? What's that? Sorry, we'll get you one. No, okay. I'm okay. Anyway, welcome. Uh, my name is Rebecca. Wait, I will we be get to drink beer? running the show. Can we drink during this? Hey guys, back at it. They are. <laughs> we're back. This is the third live show. Today. This is my third live. I feel like I've done the most work. I'm totally joking. Okay. No. Totally joking. <laughs> <I'm> totally joking. <laughs> Probably right, though. Uh, but anyway, thank you so much for joining us. Uh, we really do have a lot to go over, and we are going to get started after. You guys want to introduce yourselves? You Who know? are you? Who are you? Oh, you guys know us, right? Yeah. Well, you yeah, might. People might not. Shave a minute. Be, this they don't recognize you. You shave your beard. Okay, okay, okay. Yes, You'll so all be able to uh, see. I'm, I'm Sheldon. I promise. I uh, COO of Digital Extremes, and I'm really excited for all of the work that our team has done and to show you guys this. Um, I shaved my beard because I'm just excited. <laughs> okay, uh, great. That's what happens when you Thank get excited. You? I'm just now get right start shaving places. What the? Stop the please. <laughs> Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Next up. Uh, I'm Jeff. <laughs> we, had, we had a Jeff with a G. We had a yeah. uh, rehearsal last night, and um, a, uh, a construction crew cut the fiber optic cable yeah. that connects us to the office, and that was exciting. I was recovering it's, from my booster. I don't remember last night. And Jeff said he either. doesn't remember because he just had had his booster. Yeah, I was kind of yeah. 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 You were Needless cranky. to say, I was cranky. Life, <laughs> yeah. life had thrown everything at us for the past 24 yeah. hours. We yeah. lost six hours of internet to do builds and get everything ready for the live gameplay demo. Yeah. But Canada we're here lost now. internet. Or half a yeah, Rogers lost internet. Lost internet. Wow, but you yeah. know. Anyway, we're here now. Steve is joining us. Hello. Yeah. Hi, I'm Steve. Thanks for for tuning in. And the most sunburned and man. I'm, I'm, I'm on really the burnt. I'm Scott. Oh, oh, can we go tight on Scott? I'd no, really love no. to, I'd really love to see that burnt. No. 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 no I don't. I don't that was no. not man. That's just the. He did. That's, I'm under the brim of the hat. Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. Well, let's get things started. For some people, they might be used to because it's been our seventh Tenocon. We are so. kicking off our seventh Tenocon. We always uh, ended with what was really started as a live audience dev stream. So mm. we did that for a while, and then we did it digitally because of COVID, and now we're back to sort of the dev stream, but there's no live audience. So yeah, we're almost there. We're almost we there. We got a stage. We we're got a need. stage. We just yeah. We just need like the the fake but crowd. You Scott, could Scott, Scott you and I could just go out into the no, other thing. No. No. Okay. 
Get like a mosh pit going. Yeah. Yeah. But this is actually a great time to be a live audience member in game. If you haven't logged into the Warframe game, all platforms, the Dubiri Amphitheater is now live. This is a, actually, if you cut to Megan's screen, you can probably see it. It looks there. Um, Dean, if you want to <laughs> do it live. I don't know if you want to. Maybe yeah, not. I don't know if you want to. I don't, it just no, doesn't seem fine. to want to. That's fine. I see, <laughs> Dean is the heartbeat Your behind support everything. support is so appreciated. He's in, he's in control. Um, but the live uh, Dubiri Amphitheater is there. We have a... Um, partner experience for the live gameplay demo. So if you're in game, you will be treated to an in-game uh, partnering experience for everything we're going to show, which we're very That's excited cool. for. Get yeah. in now. This is a your warning. partnering experience? I couldn't think of a better word. Did you just word. make that up? <laughs> yes. Mm. It's a horrible a new catch on everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like you just made that up. <laughs> I've been rehearsing metaverse jokes for the stream, like for about but six months. But did I just make... But you just, you just killed it. You just were so good with that. Uh, partnering like... experience. Anyway, uh, speaking of <laughs> partnerships, we always have uh, wanted to turn TennoCon into something more than just about games. We wanted it to be a charity event. And oh, seven yes. years running, we've got to do a charity partnership. And each year, you know, we get to contribute to an organization in Canada that we firmly, firmly believe in their cause. And this year, we are thrilled to announce that thanks to the generosity of the community and just the year-over-year -year, uh, TennoCon uh, momentum, we're donating two hundred thousand dollars to Inspire. Yay! That's amazing. Yes. Whoa. So, extremely, yes. extremely, extremely exciting. That's a lot this of money. Is, uh, incredible organization. You guys. I don't know if you want to say a bit more about Inspire, but yeah, uh, we were able to get a video from them this morning uh, yeah. in our intro, but otherwise. Yeah, they're a national indigenous charity. Applause, help, please. Uh, First Nations all around Canada, education, okay. getting them started. So really uh, special organization that we've had the privilege to talk to you and be able to donate this. And we have exclamation point donate in Twitch chat if you would like to donate uh, throughout the day. Through the stream uh, appreciate it always yes. so thank you everyone uh, very very excited and we'll be able to uh, connect and make a difference yeah. so in the community Amazing. that's awesome yes Yep. Uh, and we had a couple live segments today. Uh, we had a run of show, we had an order, but then we saw all the cross-play and cross-save questions, so we're switching it around just to address <laughs> it right now. <laughs> like, we were going to do, like, a bit of... It's cancelled, we're not doing it. Whoa! No. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> I always feel like I'm at my, like, stress and nerve limit, and then we just go live and somehow... Yeah. We just crank it up a bit. See, yeah, we make it worse. It's like a test. It's, yeah. it's, I feel like I'm. We being... changed our mind. No one wants it. I no. See, there was not enough people in ch Twitch chat asking for it. If now there had just been that one extra voice, mm -hmm. your voice, the one that held back. The I was fighting the toughest it's battles. Your, it's your fault. All caps. I don't would know have, why. Would have Goodbye, turned chat. it around, but no. Oh, you're too lazy. Have a field time. Right now. <laughs> this is like a. I don't even know what supervillain would do something like this. This is the start of my Joker arc. That's for sure. This okay. Cool. All right. All right. But nevertheless, um, so crossplay, cross save. It's been a year. Last TennoCon, we showed you the work in progress That's right. versions of it all. We had the mobile build, we mm -hmm. had cross play working, we had cross save working, and That's then right. we were saying in development, stay tuned. So now we're in the stay tuned phase and we are essentially at the point now where the next thing we're gonna do is, well, twofold. First is cross play is coming first and we're starting community stress tests very soon, mm -hmm. which means we're gonna be picking some platforms. The community team and the tech teams cool. and the dev team are all gonna work together to spin up true live tests for crossplay. So this is something that the community team will have posts up about to give everyone a window into what we're doing it. And okay. it's gonna be happening soon. TM, soon TM. Yeah, soon I was TM. gonna say soon wow. TM. But <laughs> Warframe is a game that has spanned many years and there's a lot of systems in Warframe. And as we release platform over platform, we introduced things like Welcome Barrow, back to the fold, Tenno. You know, Thanks Rebellious. Uh, relics and all of these different systems that are per all database right. timers. Yep. So if you play on any console platforms, you know that you're two weeks behind Barrow Key Tears offerings. He's one of our in-game vendors. He shows up every two weeks. <laughs> and he, uh, we need to start really breaking some bones and resetting those mm -hmm. timers. Yeah, so July 29th, that's uh -oh. our goal. We're gonna do what we're calling a Barrow parody event where Barrow's gonna arrive, same place, same time, but he's going to catch everyone up, more so console, because they're, I think, yeah, they're like two manifests cool. behind. Um, so that way, Barrow is. Is crossplay really that important? It is for a lot of people. For yes, it is. At the same time. Um, mm -hmm. yes, we Obviously, not for Barrow everyone, Barrow. but it is yeah, for a Barrow. lot. Of <laughs> oh no! Marketing, oh. write that down. Uh, no, the goal is to, like Reb said, basically sync all the things that have timers, vendors, everything. Absolutely, like that. everything. Everything needs to be on the exact <laughs> yeah. same level. So now, with this Barrow Paro event, thank you. July 29th. He'll bring some new stuff as well. Uh, but the goal is to obviously just have that synced across the board, one barrel for all, and just 
bring it off. And that logic is going to be applied to everything, yes. um, whether or not you're getting the same, you know, nightmare missions, all of the mm -hmm. things that are systemically so generated. Nice. We have to unify them all yep. so that crossplay will work. This is going to be part of the stress test. And then after crossplay is proved to, you know, work, fix it, whatever we can, then that is paving the road for cross save, which mm -hmm. will pave the road for um, other things. And we are actually starting a mobile friends and family test. Yeah, it's live yeah. right now for our friends for and the staff. family. So yeah. we have a lot going on behind the scenes. The order of operations cool. is crossplay te stress tests are coming very soon. very soon. Once all of that is sorted out, we're going to take our development time going over anything we find. We're syncing things July 29th. Barrow is going to start his parody mm -hmm. events. And then once all of this is good enough to go wide, then we get the classic bullets in the Is that a jeans uh, shirt on Megan? Mm -hmm. so yes, probably. launching that. So. Awesome. Mm -hmm. That's awesome. Yeah. That's yeah. Cross exciting. say bullets in the chamber? That's Jeez, very yeah. good. Yeah. It's, a it's a partnership <laughs> between bullet and chamber. Oh, wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah, me. Yeah. Okay. So now that we've said that first, because I, I feel like the amount of pat like the amount of people that want cross play and cross save we had to move it to the front of the run of show because it is a such a key part of what keeps communities it's gonna together be, it's going to be a great but feature it, it, yeah. we, we don't want to we, we don't want to f it up we don't want to launch cross save and then all of a sudden That's turn it off there. immediately and then have to turn it off and then yep. some poor tenos account is lost in eternalism of the version of them that didn't get I love you know, how honest rescued, they are rescued so we have to be, <laughs> nice. wow. you know that scene in the new these references that sounds, are just like yeah, yeah, yeah that sounds yeah. very bad <laughs> oh my god. Dang. All oh. right. Okay. But anyway, so we're starting with parody events. Yep. Uh, and then we have also, I think there's also like relay destruction things that have yes. to get synchronized as well. Yep. So bringing the databases kind of to heal and mm -hmm. then off we go. Yep. Okay, great. Awesome. Yep. There's a list and we're going to get it all done. Yep. That's how we go. That's cool. Okay. There right. you go. That's the update. Well, or it's canceled if you believe me. <sighs> Who are you going to believe? I don't know. Choose. One of us is right. <laughs> <laughs> it's not Steve. <laughs> okay. Well, we'll see. But anyway, uh, we are going to now give stuff away, kind of. Oh. As we do. As we do. What are we giving oh, away? Oh, some free would stuff. Would you like to see? I would we're not Dean. actually giving it away. We're launching a giveaway. You no. have to enter this. But would you uh, like to see it? Yeah. Dean, play that Oh, clip. is this the computer? Yeah. Oh. Computer. Okay, this is yeah, the one we were yeah, talking yeah. about earlier. Yeah. This thing's amazing. This thing is absolutely amazing. If you go to co.tv slash Warframe, you can enter this, and if you use my, co my code co-carnage, you can get like 15 extra entries. Go enter this right now. Co.tv slash Warframe. Yep, do it. Seems ridiculous. Is it worldwide? Yes, it's pretty much worldwide. It is so badass. It looks like a ship from Homeworld. I remember Homeworld. Oh man, I love it. Mm -mm. How does that even? <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> this is the first time Sheldon's seen this. I've never like, seen that thing. So like, that, oh, we need it. a banana for scale. So where do you that, plug your? That's a four foot tall. It's almost four feet tall. It's a solid red. Yeah. It's even a little bit taller. Yeah. That's, yeah. A tall, yeah. tall, yeah. that's a four foot tall computer. It's made by PC Modder, AK Mod. They have built four this one feet of a kind tall. custom oh, PC. Amazing. Theremin 10 Zero yeah. Tower. It's incredible. Wow. Um, this is actually a Gleam giveaway, and it's going to be live until August 16th. So if you're in Twitch chat, you can just do exclamation point giveaway and it'll get you a nice little link uh, so you can you, you can't win it if you work at digital stream win it i'm sorry you cannot win it okay. i'm sorry but or you put could. an order in for one you yeah. Could. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> exclamation point giveaway get all the information on it uh again august 16th you have until then wow. so get yourself a chance at a four foot tall <laughs> Theremin 10 Zero PC. One of a kind. That tower. Amazing. It's insane. That wild. Amazing. Yeah. Honestly, amazing work uh, putting that whole Beautiful. Uh, computer and giveaway campaign together. Good job, team. That is nice. the best computer I've ever awesome. seen and will ever have. Awesome I know. Computers. It's like out of reach. It hurts. You, we give. But it we, hurts. And this is the internalism where we don't get this. Yeah. <laughs> well, well, we don't know. We could. Wow, we could. We could. Yeah. Internalism right. jokes. Love we it. We had a lot happen today. We did. And at 4 p.m., something really exciting happened. We deployed a update on all platforms today. Uh, if you haven't got it yet, you can download the update. Get in the Duviri Amphitheater. Mm -hmm. It's on Earth. But yes, the update went live on all platforms today, and we launched Core Prime. She's out. She's here. Whoa. Core Prime Access. We That's debuted crazy. it on the art panel. Core Little Prime tease. You were there. Was I? <laughs> yeah. Did you spoil That's it again? <laughs> Eternalism. Yeah. Jeff spoiled it again for sure. Trouble. But uh, the perhaps best maybe we should show the Prime trailer. Oh, we have a Prime trailer? Oh, sure do. Sure do. Dean, roll it. You mean it. you didn't spoil it? <laughs> Here we go. 
go. None of them truly understands how much I lost when I lost her. Nor by what subtle art my dead love now lives within another's gleaming skull. So tonight, we shall celebrate in her honor and mine. I shall unveil a new creation, a harmony of mistress and monster. companion unsurpassed blood raw in whip claw and fang Cora. cool fun what's my code co-carnage all one word co-carnage <laughs> that's like yeah. that's like yeah. posing amplified i right? know that pose. <laughs> core prime <laughs> that's all <laughs> Okay. That's how I'm going to show my butt from now on. Yeah. We will not be showing any butts on no. this stream. Okay? No butts no on butts. this stream no allowed. Definitely not. Zero oh, butts. butts. All right. Okay. So that is the Core Prime Access butts. trailer again launched today. We did. You know what we should also launch? What else should we launch? A giveaway. Oh, we do the oh, first yeah. Core Prime yes. Access Oh, yes. that, yes. I think I propose. Who's the first one? You're close this is to see. You're going to have to read it. You're also the only one with laser eye surgery. You're really asking Sheldon to do this. Oh, I can't wait. Oh, God. That's why he's sitting there. If you have to go get a snack, go now while Sheldon tries to read the giveaway. We're going to give away a Core Prime Access to one lucky Twitch viewer. Let's go. Let's go. Could it be you? The answer is. Oh, it's scrolling by. Oh, it's. Phase jump. Phase jump. Phase jump. Hey, oh, it's PH, jump. PH like us. PH, A's jump. PH, Play, placeholder. 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 placeholder A's jump. So phase jump. <laughs> you have just won the first Core Prime giveaway of the year. Congrats. She launched today. The Prime access is all Way yours. Go. Live awesome. message wow. your Twitch page and we'll hook you up. We'll the you first up. ever. So That's have, ready. I think we have key art we can show in case you want a closer look at her yeah. and all her beauty. The team did a fantastic yeah. job with wow. Cora and her it's good. Venari Prime. Mm -hmm. That's cool. I tried the tomato prime, chips. I tried the the all the, the, really awesome. the all ones. Just I think there was awesome. some ketchup so in there. Oh man, I love that trailer. I love just love this yeah. design and yep. just listening to Ballas. Yeah. Scott Scott was saying he could listen to him just like reading bedtime stories. All dressed. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm sure you're not yep. alone in the community yep. for that. He needs like a redemption arc, maybe like new war kind of. Don't spoil it. He's not so... Okay, never yeah. mind. Yeah. <laughs> never mind, never mind. Some people haven't played the new war, but you should. But you okay. haven't yet. That's okay. Maybe, maybe that was redemption. like his brother. You should play the new war. There's always awesome. room for redemption. Maybe, maybe, it's, maybe he's got like a twin brother. Yeah. That's, oh, you know, yeah. like way more lovable. Yeah. More family. <laughs> right. We were separated at birth. One was, yeah. you know, lived in a like cabin. I need like a light switch like an elementary school teacher. Like <laughs> <laughs> we start Quiet time. Quiet time. Quiet time. Quiet time now. 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 Wave. Yeah. Yes. But we also launched today, if you're a fan of, actually, oh, if you're watching and you have your account linked, you can get Titania Prime for free. Yeah, oh. 30 minutes. Yes. Make sure you have those drops And good. we also launched a Titania skin today, the Donan, the Donan skin, Donan. which deluxe is skin. a deluxe skin. Everything's there. Which also showed in the art show, but you don't remember that. Retro oh, makers. Thank you, bud. It was like a month ago. Yeah. Don't trust him, but um, it's fine. Don't trust don't him. Don't trust him. It's all in <laughs> memory. Yes, the... Oh, there it is. Look at the key art. That was amazing. Yeah, wow. that was cool. Oh, yeah. man. I do love Very that cool. so it's much. Got the Lux razor wings and everything. Dex Pixel. So all you have to do is watch this and you get them. No, 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 be interested to that use your new so a skin God. on Rick your Rick loves this. <laughs> he just loves this. 
<laughs> Listen, it was so. He's just clapping. It's yes. co-carnage, Damien Gaming. Mm, never mind. Never mind. Oh, okay. We're good. We're Sorry. Good. All right. Can't um, help myself. Yeah. So that's Ooh. all live in uh, the update today. That's all live and going live tomorrow. We did announce, uh, pre-announce at this, but Nightwave Norris Choice Volume Two mm. is going live tomorrow at the Classic Week. Oh, Palfi. No, 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 no. It's 8 p.m. Eastern time. You absolutely uh, can start Warframe right now. There's never been a better time. Nightwave. She's gonna have yeah. new cosmetics. The game's awesome. It has a whole new well. tutorial and experience. And if you're unfamiliar with what Nightwave, give it a try. It's free. Like give it a try. Kind of seasons pass. We used to do have an alert system, but we took that out, and now we do Nightwave. So it's voiced by Nora Knight, which is uh, super fun, and it's just a, a nice little free path for some cosmetics. She's got her own store, and you do acts uh, yeah. every week. Yep, completely free. Just way to earn stuff while playing. Oh, his hair. Launch I know. Tomorrow. I'm surprised too. Nightwave. Stuff. Nightwave, baby. Fantastic. Yeah. All right. Uh, we usually start a little bit more on our Tenno Lives with a little bit of a recap, and there's one thing from the panels today that we wanted to bring Remember up. It? Uh -oh. Um, oh, uh oh, the art from the art panel. Oh no, spoiler! <laughs> what did I do? No. What did you do? They so, always they always attack you, kind of Jeff. Surprised. Like, where's the skin that you showed? I was actually genuinely surprised at the art panel how much we were allowed to show on the art panel. Oh wow! So yeah. someone gave you permission to show it. Well, this, this is the first time I've ever or tried this. <laughs> That's how we work around here. That's how we work. Yes, but we were, you know, we've been working on Warframe for quite some time, and we we're always looking for new ideas for our next Warframes, and we got the opportunity to work with industry legend, from comics to video games, Joe Mad. And Joe Mad had been working on a wolf-inspired Warframe, oh, iterating on it and bringing all these ideas to the table, and we ended up with a concept that we're going to be using for a future Warframe of our wolf-inspired Warframe. Let's take a look at what um, Joe Mad worked on. We had Eric Vetter here oh, working man. from DE side, and Not bad. you know, it's uh, a thing of beauty. She will be having like quite the, uh, <laughs> the the power set, and you can look forward to hearing more about that uh, in your future dev streams. Just howlingly good. Howlingly good. <laughs> wow, he's been saving that. Oh, that was pretty great. Has this been like this has been, been requested for? The, it's like an Elden the, Ring ball yeah. inspired. Well, I feel like you started this, didn't it? No, I don't no, think I did. Vampires. <laughs> oh, yeah. Other yeah, yeah. Things. Monsters, guys. Yeah. They're cool. <laughs> Monsters are in. Monsters are in. They were never out. Oh, they were never out. No. Monsters are always uh, in. Uh, but uh, there's no, uh, you know, there's some, um, it's not a coincidence that we were, mm. you know, lucky enough to work with Joe Mad on, on this. Yeah, I mean, we're, everyone here at D, we're huge fans of Joe Mad. He's just, you know, he, like you were saying, he's just. And all just, the games that him and his team work on oh in Airship. Oh my God, the, 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 the team okay, yeah. at Airship. He has a 90s kid though, 90s comics and stuff. Yeah. Like, oh yeah. Come on. Totally. Yeah. You can't, you can't not. And, and the team that they have at Airship Syndicate is a fantastic one. And we're excited to kind of talk about the next steps that DE is taking in partnership what? with Airship Syndicate. Maybe we should roll it. Let's take a look. Hey, Tenocon! Hey, Tenocon. Don't swivel, Steve. You're already swiveling. I know. <coughs> Ooh, hey. <coughs> Drop some hot bars, Joe. I can talk louder. I'm the loudest talker. <laughs> Do you have enough tape for all this? To... They don't have tapes anymore, Steve. It's the future. <laughs> <laughs> and I feel like we had great banter. We did have great banter? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> hey, everyone. This is Joe Mad from Airship Syndicate. Hope you guys are enjoying TennoCon. Unfortunately, we couldn't be there this year. I did have the honor of designing a brand new Warframe. Hope you had a chance Welcome to Welcome back to the a fold, Tenno. Thanks, Von Snuggle. We're working on next, and we haven't been able to talk about it. It's something we're really excited about. It's our best game yet. Hey, I'm Steve Matarera, one of the lead designers at Airship Syndicate. I'm Ryan Stefanelli. I'm the president and game director here at Airship. And we're really excited to be partnering with Digital Extremes on our next big thing. It's a third-person action game. New original characters, original world, uh, never been seen before. We never would have tried this type of game right away. That's why we started with something like Battle Chasers. Then we dabbled in multiplayer with Darksiders Genesis. And now we're, we're going all in with this new game. This is our biggest game yet. We're building a much larger world than we ever have before. But for this, it's really more of a world that you live Ooh. in, potentially every day for years to come. We've been fans of many genres over the years, and we've sort of worn those influences on our sleeve. One genre we never really thought that we could touch on is MMOs. For us, like, we played a lot of games together online, so it's fun for us to finally get to work on a game like this where we're building a world that players can experience together. I don't think we would have tackled this type of online game without a partner like DE, a group that knows how to do it. I was actually one of the people who bought into the initial Founders Pack. I still have my Excalibur Prime. You know, Warframe is touted as one of the most successful 
games of its kind, it's always evolving and introducing exciting stuff, and we definitely do not want to blunder through something like that. This game is really character focused. The characters have personalities, they have relationships with each other. We want players to feel excited about all of the different characters that they're going to have in their arsenal. We're mixing in a lot of modern sensibilities and modern technology into those fantasy definitions to create something. Welcome brand. back to the full Tenno. Is the sense of adventure and camaraderie. The secret locations. It's got an identity. People are going to be so jazzed. This project represents really So many buzzwords, I'm so confused. <laughs> Go big. To everyone that has supported us since the beginning, I can honestly say this game is for you guys. We didn't get to say a lot of details and specifics about the game, but we'd love for everyone to talk to us on Discord, get involved in our social channels, and get ready for this December's TGAs where it'll all be revealed. Oh, wow. Cross promo into cross promo. That is that is the PR future right there. Nice. Indeed, indeed. Like you it. can check out the Game Awards later this year to see what exactly the game is. But And they're going to have the Schick robot back. It's going to be amazing. <laughs> sorry, sorry. <laughs> sorry. Why me? Sorry. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> what did I do? Sorry. Well, <laughs> well, sorry. well, that's all right. I can't believe he's got... Like a founder pack, and he's got yeah. so exciting. And and like, that's just, crazy. Just you wait, folks. Wow, that we're that's gonna, so awesome. Good games are coming. Everything's coming. That's, that's true. Yeah. That, is, that is, what did you say about the partnership synergies? <laughs> oh, yeah, but I don't remember. Well, this is it. Oh, yeah. This is it. All those things. What did you call it? I don't know. I think you just called it a partnership. I think I just said partner. No, there's, no. no. there's, there's more. It was a TM. There. It was a TM. I okay. don't we'll, we'll know. Remember. A partnering? Did no. I make it an active verb? No, that's yuck. <laughs> Workshop that. If only okay. we could see, if only we, we could see chat, they would tell us. Yeah, chat. Chat would me. definitely be telling us. Yes. But we don't have a chat feed. We yes. just have, we just, just have us. us. Yeah. Time to talk Warframe. Oh, oh okay. yeah, yeah. Let's do Oh, that. Warframe. I've heard of that. Yes, we have <laughs> been working hard on, you know, getting everyone ready to see a taste of the Duberry Paradox. You're probably seeing some key elements on stage. But what if we told you we were working? Come on, on come on. Play oh. Something for the post New War side of Warframe. I think all of us, you know, came out of the new war, released in December. It's been just over seven months. A Viso dating sim? Please. <laughs> no spoilers. <laughs> no spoilers. Oh. Hmm. But uh, we, Welcome we really back want to, the fold, to take Tenno. what we did with the new war and all Thanks the amazing overpowered. content in it and bring it to you, Tenno, in a new update. Let's take a look at what's coming soon. Here we go. <sighs> Okay. Veilbreaker is an update that oh, cool brings. Cool name, too. Veilbreaker? Mm -hmm. like, I love that yeah, name. it's a pretty yeah. good name. You like it? Yeah. <laughs> yep. <laughs> yep. We're going to give that one to you. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> good job, Rev. Good job. Breaking Veils. Breaking Veils. But Veilbreaker is an update that's dedicated to the state of the origin system that you know after the New War. So if you play the New War, a lot of things are really going to stand out from that trailer. Um, and if you haven't, you'll be introducing yourself to a lot of those characters soon, we hope. You know, maybe you want to try out the New War. And this is really going to take the state of the origin system and the conflict and everything 
I don't want to say too much because I don't want to spoil it for people that didn't play the new war, mm -hmm. but a lot of what of that video showcased, hopefully you can really infer where we're going with it. Mm -hmm. And um, there's going to be a ton to talk about, and we are hoping that the Veilbreaker update is going to come out before the Duviri Paradox. We'll keep mm -hmm. you posted on development updates, dev streams, but we're hoping you can get your hands on it this year. So mm -hmm. uh, we'll have dev streams to talk about it, uh, but we wanted to introduce you, Tenno, to Veilbreaker as an update, uh, show you a tra trailer of what you can definitely expect in it. Uh, but one thing absent from that trailer mm. that's a very mm. important part of the Veilbreaker update mm. is the fact that we are going to be releasing our 50th unique Warframe. 50. 5-0. Five 5-0, zero. Five zero, baby. Oh, oh man. Yeah. And that's oh, I think I need a, I think it, I know, I need a moment. <laughs> yeah. It kind of hurts. <laughs> yeah. I remember when we were pitching this game, Scott will remember this, yeah. we were pitching this game uh, when we didn't think we could do it independently mm -hmm. way back in... Uh, is that 10 years ago now? It was 10, 10 years, years ago. ago. 10 yeah. years ago. And I think, how many Warframes do we have? Eight at the time? And they said. I don't even think we had eight. I don't think we had eight. I think we were like four, six. Four six. that were really yeah. solid four, and six, six that were. And a, yeah. a, a prominent executive asked, well, like, are you worried you're going to run out of ideas for Warframe? Because you already got yeah. six. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and now we're at and now we have 50. Exciting. We're at 50. I'm just checking on our servers. As you know, we do an ambitious live event. Everything. Oh, how's you know, everything going? We're oh. just taking a look. Sit tight. Plenty of room. Sit tight, everyone. Um, we won't. Uh, if you're having connectivity issues, don't worry. Team is on it. Sit tight. We'll okay. get you updates. Oh, soon. so things are heating up in the hamster. Things are heating up. Okay, yeah, the hamster spinning wheels very fast. I can hear. I can hear them. I should have changed their wood chips. Yes. You know, and yeah. it's just they're not going to yeah. run as fast. Yes. Okay. Without the fresh but, wood chips. So on the 50th 50. Warframe topic, uh, we're going to be debuting fully in a, uh, well, why don't we give you a little tease of how you're going to learn about the 50th Warframe. Oh, oh yeah. this is cool. <laughs> <laughs> Styanax will be making his reveal in an animated short that we will be uploading closer to the launch it's not of even a short. It's no, it's like a, it's like a six-minute little short film. Welcome back to the fold, with, uh, Tenno. Passion Paris, I yes. believe. Yeah. Um, cool. But we will be yep. showing that uh, a Spartan very, Warframe. You know, closer to the Veilbreaker okay. okay. information bits yeah. and everything. Yep. But that is Styanax. He is our 50th unique Warframe, and mm -hmm. you can learn all about yep. him and his. That looks so sick. Honestly, it's, yeah. it's yeah. honestly really great. That's right up my street. Gorgeous. Yeah. 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 His. I'm excited for people to see. Can you believe? And it's going to give me, like, uh, from then till when it releases, from now until it releases, I'm going to be practicing how to say the name of the Styanax? Warframe. Yeah, I'm going to be practicing. His <laughs> origin is of that mm. of the noble Greek warriors. Mm -hmm. Styanax. 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 <laughs> Styanax. Yeah. Okay, forget it. You got it. Yeah. Nailed right. it. Megan, no, it is easy to say. I'm, so, I'm being a goof. Yep. To recap, Star for, Star those, Star for those of you doing bullet points for your viewers or for mm. your videos, Failbreaker coming soon. Dianax, the 50th Warframe, Stinax. and a lot more. Stinax. Might have spotted Protea Deluxe in that trailer. Very true. Artex. Oh. Tough to say. Yeah. yeah. You're just making up words now. Trailer. Somebody said this in chat, yeah. and now I can't now, unsee Megan, it. Megan, I noticed you have some stuff Where's on Megan line? down here? I thought I'd sit here with a bunch <laughs> of things on that one. I just can't. These segways are getting so <laughs> sophisticated. <laughs> 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 I just love holding things. Is there a reason you have stuff on your lap? Oh no, I God. just, I love it. No, I would like to give it away. I don't want to be holding it anymore. <laughs> oh, I want I see. you to be holding it. Uh, we have a couple giveaways oh, from... Oh, is it your iPad with your no. notes? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> so we have uh, we were lucky enough to be sponsored uh, by HP Omen to give away some stuff. And a full laptop. Okay. Oh, look at that wolf <laughs> inspired <laughs> art. Woo! Uh, oh. Dean's got assets. Oh, Don't cool. worry, no. it's coming up. This All is right. um, a, um, HP Omen. They have been giving us mm -hmm. some sweet one-of-a-kind things to give away. Yes. Uh, first bundle we're going to give away live Twitch Picker is going to be the oh. headset and the keyboard with the custom keycaps. I like that we have assets, but you made Megan hold it. Yeah. yeah. Did I, I make you? Hold I it? made myself. <laughs> That's what I thought. I requested that the items be here so that I could hold it. This is my own you fault. Cool. Anyways, yeah. custom PC and also the custom headset. So it's running oh, right wow. now. Where's the headset? Sheldon. Here we go. Right here. Oh, yeah, the oh, winner. Oh my God. The winner is, <laughs> I can't read that. Oh yes, it's, it's, yes. it's AO92561053. Oh, wow. What an amazing. amazing. Best reading yet. Yeah. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that's the hack with Sheldon is just numbers. Just numbers. Okay, that's actually my account. 
Okay. All right, that account, please whisper a Warframe Twitch channel with your in-game alias and your shipping information so we can send you this keyboard. Did you request and this color this pattern? Headset. I, no, but aren't yeah, we so did. excited about it? You totally Don't did. you love it? That's cool. Like this one too. Like, I know. I'm you know? Can I see the laptop? Yeah, no, of course. Don't He's going to take it. Give it oh, oh. If he drops it, just... You can't have it, but you can have it. We're also now giving away this laptop. And, and headset as another well. Another pair of headsets uh, via the Twitch picker. So, Dean, roll it. Let's see if it's a more complicated one for Sheldon. Okay. Let's see if we can trip him up. Oh, oh, oh. bit of feedback. Feedback. Bit of an echo. This oh. one is Her Esther Palace Puff. <laughs> Congrats. Uh, her, her, hey, life hack is her, Here's Dirk, Dirk, her's Derp Palace? Derp Lips. Her's <laughs> here's Derp Lips. No, wait. There is oh my God, something. Here's Derp Lips. Her and Derp Lips. All right. Opalips. Are you zooming in with your camera? Yes, <laughs> I am. He's meta. Dianax. No, no. <laughs> uh, you've won our custom laptop giveaway oh, wow. with headset. Mm -hmm. uh, and this is yours. You need to make sure. Thank you. Brown White Fire, appreciate in it. Whispering, send it to us as a direct message on Twitch, your shipping address, so we can yes. or broadcast it to everybody. No, nope, don't do that. not do that. Thank you to Old Man for uh, setting this over and creating these. Uh, can't wait for those. Uh, the code is Co Carnage. Welcome if you're back entering. to the fold. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe we should also do Power Plat. Oh, wait, where is it? Wouldn't you like a hundred thousand platinum? Oh, it's here. Mm -hmm. Wouldn't you like I that? I sure would. Nice. Hundred thousand. Nice. You're entering nice. here. Yeah. It's I don't even we green like these ones, but anyway. Yeah, Co Carnage. Ask for forgiveness, not permission. What a hundred thousand. That's how I work. All right. All right. All right. What the hundred thousand? Uh, quad ver. Wow. Quad ver. That's the. That's the quad, quad underscore. Quad that was quick. Uh, you won. Uh, guys, they just won a hundred thousand platinum. Holy crap! That's a lot. Good job. Uh, how are how are we holding up? Should uh -oh. we kick off the theater or? Uh, Glenn says we recovered. Oh, good. Oh. The, right. the the the, the swamping the swamping web situation real quick. Okay. <laughs> to make sure <laughs> to make sure that I'm in place. <laughs> you want me to take all the belongings? That sure. I'll take the laptop. Like, no, let's give it to you. Here you go, Sheldon. Oh man. All right. What we're Sorry, do, winners. Okay. You're never getting these. <laughs> yeah, Sheldon's taking them. Let me do a little. So so far, um, you have got to see the Veilbreaker update reveal. You've got to see a lot of uh, you know things that are live build for you and. Tease of Steinax. Tease of Steinax. Amazing. And we are now going to go into the World Reveal live. Oh, this is, is World that's Reveal? Right now? It. It's literally time. Okay. Oh, I'll that's that way. Right. So I have to go over to the demo PC. So yep. I'm just going to draw my notes here. Uh, anything you want to say? Well, I, I thought we were going to stall more or something. Yeah, I, I know. just have a look at chat. This feels sudden to me. There it is. We're, uh, we're ready to rock. Oh my All gosh. Right. Are you guys ready? Is everyone, is everyone ready for this? No. As I walk over the stage ceremoniously. <laughs> just anything, so you know. Anything to say? Oh, I just I want to say, like, this isn't a volume. This is not ILM. Like, this is real. Like, just like, 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 this is real, you know? <laughs> this is not like an Obi-Wan show. It's not a green you know? screen. Like, it's, not it's physical. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. All right. Okay, we're going to sit quiet. You, okay. You guys ready? Well, what's there to say? Is there, is there, no, is there no, like, um, Camera for you on? No, no, no. Oh yeah, all right. All right, let's get started. Just a voice. Just Wait, a voice. get in game. <laughs> a uh, voice please. from the void. If you aren't in game, go to the Daviri Amphitheater on Earth. Megan's there now, and we're gonna start the show. Yeah, this is gonna be a really cool kind of interleaved show. Oh, look how cool this is. Yeah, awesome. What? Okay, so people are there, so things are working. Things are working. Yeah. No. No. It's just all the way. As we wait for the Daviri paradox, there's something everyone should know about it, which is that it's going to come earlier in the game than you'd expect. Mm. The Daviri paradox is indeed a paradox, and to that end, you may find yourself wondering if you are required to play the new war, to play the Dabiri Paradox. And the answer is no. No. It'll be earlier in the Warframe journey, and we're going to be taking it in lots of strange and weird directions to that end. Because what is a paradox if not an anomaly in time and space? And for us, taking all those themes and pushing them into this update has been a lot of fun and, frankly, quite exciting for the future of Warframe. Yeah, I can't wait to see it. The Daviri Amphitheater is live on all platforms, and our gracious host, Bombastine, will invite you to participate 
in the Deviri Paradox amphitheater experience. I'm trying. Get in and there. If it doesn't start soon, I'm just gonna wait. Just, can... We're waiting. Go oh. back to the couch. We're letting everyone get in. Everyone needs to be able All to right. see this. The, we can see the, the numbers rising. We have a little ticker over on the side. Every relay keeps fill, filling up. Thanks guys for coming in. But we're gonna give them a, a few more minutes. We don't wanna start the demo without uh, everybody in place. So bear with us. All right. Oh. Welcome not back anymore. to the fold, Tenno. Scott, Thank you, Neocats. I'm not even watching the ticker. Thank you, Nate's Gaming. <laughs> Scott's terrified. I can't watch, you there, can't watch the ticker. Can't thank watch you, thank you. you. All right, I'll just go ahead with the demo. All right. All right, we're going to start. Get ready. Oh, hold on. So Megan, Megan's getting, it's, it's making its way through. The demo is about to begin. Packets are being handed around. Ever get that feeling you're stuck, spinning inside your little wheel day in and day out, only to find you're right back where you started? And so it goes, day by day, year by year, spinning and spinning until you're dead. Or in my case, until you're dead inside, never asking, what am I doing this for? Whose dream am I living? Sentenced to death by royal order of his majesty, Dominus Thrax, hero of all. Get on with it. Death by impalement. Dude, that's awesome that it adds color.
Oh, is he trying to get to the bridge before the worm gets there? This is, it's, it's almost like a roguelike. This is the intro quest to the Daviri Paradox. So what you're seeing right now is the onboarding experience for the quest. The king. There goes our honored king. Where? Where? He gave me no eyes to see him. There! I think it's him. Sir, will the dragon devour us today? I live to serve even as food. What? Is that the dragon too? Didn't you hear it? <laughs> Someone can tell me how our eater event's going. All right, no worries. This is an open world experience, but it has a lot of twists. The world does not look vibrant, it looks rather colorless. Our drifter is living the same day, but something has changed. This world looks incredible. Is a Disney princess confirmed? I am. Hundred percent. The king graces us. I am Bombastine, sire. You do remember your courtly playwright. Hey, hey! I am not. Have you come to join the performance, sire? It would be my deepest honor to see you command the stage. Yonder, you might recover your favorite mask. My favorite mask? Yes, manifest as only you are able. With untold power as only you command. Quicksire. I can only stall this awful idiot's gallery for a while longer. Evidently, we have to go find a mask. Perhaps we can get some assistance. Oh, oh it's like a waypoint finder. Is the server still down? Yeah. I've been trying to log in the whole time. How do I know this? You're not trying to kill me. Thank you. 
go. The king returns! And in such a mood as this he wears. What recitation will you gift us today? I'm not... Uh... Shit. Blind feet? Of course, sire. Which play? Now here we find ourselves with a very important decision. As you play through the open world Daviri Paradox experience, you're going to be given opportunities to choose your attributes, your build Passes. for that particular day, that play session. In this case, players of veteran players of Warframe, uh, even new ones will recognize heat damage as a, you know, a way to get your melee built up. Uh, in this case, we have the option to instantly summon and mount a loyal cave, which happens to be that skeletal force. It's an actual roguelike. Rebuke, which is uh, a, a decree that allows you to have a burst when you um, dodge. I'm gonna go with Loyal Steed just to show this off um, during TennoCon here today. Uh, this is going to be something that you'll have, so you don't need to choose from it normally, but um, we're just gonna use it today for the demo. God. When I bestride when him, I, bestride I, him, I, I soar. soar. I am a I, hawk. I am a hawk. He trots the he air. He trots the air. The earth sings the when earth he touches sings it. When he touches Welcome it. back to the, the fold, Tenno. Of his hoof the is we crave your patience for just a little longer musical. than the pipe of Hermes. The pipe of Hermes. Riveting. <sighs> I was on the edge of my seat. Moving. Well done, sire. Acting! They love you. Right. Applause, please. Deviri is a strange place. It is a place where your choices will allow you to build builds for your drifter and what's to come. And let's take a look at using that uh, decree right now. Instant horse. But where to next? Okay. There's another one of these statues here. So let's take a look at that. And light it up. Go, go. Oh god. I thought I had lost you for a moment. But you don't get to leave. Ah. So now I've chosen my respawn point. And I can escape the dragon. The aura worm node. Safety in the caves, Tenno. Shot small art. Run true, noble Kaith. Cool. Very strange place, folks. Wait, what? Now, of course, this is a Warframe update, but this is also the introductory quest to the Duberry Paradox. So we, we'll see where this goes. <laughs> Took the hand, did you? 
Hessian? What? Finally? Today's the first... Fool! You know how this works. Why would today be the first time? Your ignorance is second only to your apathy. What I struggle to comprehend is why the other side is even trying to help you. <laughs> the other side? Who's trying to help me? <laughs> uh, you are. See for yourself. You should make a choice here, I think. See where it goes. Gotta stay true to the poster boy. <laughs> I thought so. Old dogs and new tricks. Go on, go wallow in your routine. Fine, I'm getting out of here on my own. Oh, now, that would be a surprise, wouldn't it? Take my old blade if you want a chance with that mockery of a Dax. Perhaps we're simply not ready yet to take on a Warframe. I see. Until next time. We're unveiled in scars and sorrows. I cannot... Only know that something has compelled him to watch and wait. Cool. Well, has Now the cowardly knight must face the king's champion. Enter Danthius. Welcome back to the fold, Tenno. Thank you, Amoyo. Interloper. one way to take down an airborne beast. And I hope I have the tools to do so. Here we go. <laughs> what the actual hell? Are we supposed to, what? what?
that looks totally badass. That looks like that looks like a standalone game. What the hell, man? How dare he keep trying to leave? What's out there that's so fascinating? That's like they took they they put like a single player adventure game just in Warframe. Maybe They're like, here you go. I We're just gonna call it a mission. Just but go there. Dude, that looks that looks absolutely nutty. That looks absolutely nutty. That is su Winter 2022. Oh, look at that! It's gonna Welcome be out this year. Welcome back to the full <laughs> Tenno. And that is. Oh, 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 oh no! All right. We're caught in the paradox. Did it work? Oh, no. Oh, God. <laughs> uh, I'm so easily excitable, but uh, that's so awesome. The open world experience coming with the Devere Paradox is going to be everything you'd love about Warframe. Your builds and everything you know is going to come to you through this drifter's point of view. The experience where you start off as the underdog and as you play through, your decrees will be bound to you for that play session. And we're really trying to play with very different things for this open world experience. Narrative. Uh, you know, there are those three frames in the cave. That was a sick callback. Yeah, 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 I love that. Or call forward because of the paradox. I call, oh. oh, I can't even make sense <laughs> yeah. of it all. Eternalism has yeah. messed me up. <laughs> so, yeah, and you got to see a little bit of the amphitheater, uh, the Debiri amphitheater experience. It had a live show there that if you're probably in a relay still right now. You're still in there, the dragon's probably <laughs> roaring around. <laughs> yeah, be careful. Logan, be don't careful. leave because Bombastine uh, does have a farewell for you. In a bit, but you can hang that out, is hang so out cool, dude. That is a fantastic I mean, model. Toby Maguire reference, but I was thinking an alt title would be Unpleasant Bill. <laughs> okay. Okay. No, that's that not landing for anyone, eh? Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Sorry, we get I'm it. Old. We're just not laughing. Yeah, no. like, yeah. <laughs> that, awesome. yeah. yeah. that was unbelievable. I just yeah, love right. the color, the dragon, and the flying around the dragon. Stunning. There is a stunning. Cool. There's That's things awesome. happening, cooking. And that old guy, who's that old guy? Who's that old guy? <laughs> With those mm. swords. I feel like I, I recognize his voice. I but... recognize him, but I want to know more. <laughs> oh my god. And the oh yeah. The yep. cave and their winged the winged beast. The, the, winged the beast. descent from They're the acting sky. like we didn't see that the person talking was I mean, Teshin in the <laughs> subtitles. Yeah, yeah. Hopefully you I wonder who that is. The reveal of the Devere Paradox. That was the quest <laughs> or part of the quest for you to start off your journey. And we're going to be working very and that's very, this year. Very, very hard on it to get yes. it. Yes. Yes. Like, this the year. Team. And we had one of the relay events worked. No, I think we had two. We had Teshin. Subtitles and... oh, spoiling yes. again. I know, right? The horse. Yes. Yep. Yeah. They were, right. I think people were able to experience uh, some of it. My PC was having a bit of a struggle. So, oh. you know what? Maybe we'll play that experience again at a later date. Just like we, we did last year. Yeah. Yeah. We'll show it again. Yeah. Yeah. We'll show it again. Yeah. 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 We'll do it again. Yeah. For sure. if, 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 if there were any issues, we will run it again. Yes. Our uh, IT team is working right now feverishly to try to even get those last two working. Oh, they said his name in the amphitheater, too? Their work. Uh, and I appreciate, of course, everyone's interest in cramming in there and wanting to watch it with us. And yeah, oh yeah, beautiful. Great job, man. Yeah. I just love the way the color works and just that thing in the sky. Oh, oh, God. God. Yeah, yeah, there's going to be a lot uh, with this update. You may have noticed the world changed a lot when we came in and out. And moves are a huge part of what make oh. each day feel different. Are you mad? He's mad, watch he's out. mad. Yeah. yeah, watch out. Awesome. Okay, so is that it? Kind of. <laughs> 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 kind of not. I don't know. Well, yeah, I guess, uh, yeah. I, I probably was supposed to be prepared to have like a more structured speech, but, uh, you know, it's. Why start now? We've only why, been doing why this be structured years. now? <laughs> why, why start? Let's do this. Uh, do. But yeah, I'm, this is, I guess, we wanted to share with our community um, some news about the growth of. DE Amazing growth. and the growth of the team and um, I, I guess I can probably just do it with symbolism you know yes. and just kind of do this right yes symbolism and just you know if you've been with us for a while what color are those? Are those faded? Or they they've been, they've been washed, they've been washed a few times. This is why it's more white. Yeah. Yeah. This is yeah. why it's a yeah. wicked contrast. Oh my gosh. Uh, and uh, I think it's time that uh, Warframe has a new leader. <laughs> and uh, and it's going to be you. 
And I'll put these on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't put them on now. <laughs> no, I mean, they are clean. I said no, no butts. butts. No, um, butts. Yeah. no butts today. Yeah. But yeah, I think well. it's, you know, we started this game uh, more than 10 years ago. And uh, we, it's a big, important part of our lives. And, yeah, and, and we made it in a way that, that we hadn't made games before, which was with all of you at home, Community, yeah. uh, supporting us, mm -hmm. funding us when we didn't have uh, a publisher and we were kind of striking out on our own. And, and uh, this is something that we are going to try again. Uh, and as, a, you know, the younger generation uh, is going to take over Warframe and, and, and phase in <laughs> that. You're old. Never the, old, old. the old buggers. <laughs> uh, my beard Welcome has maybe, back maybe to the just fold, a little Kendall. bit of pepper left in the salt. Uh, the old buggers are going to try to do it again with you at home. And uh, oh. I think that's probably all there is to say about it for now. We have prepared for you mm -hmm. a taste of that experience that we want uh, you to join us with oh its creation wait a second so thank you very much for that amazing mm -hmm. the very demo yeah. and yeah it's time to see the next story that we're adding to the studio's you know legacy going forward i hope yeah i hope you like it oh they're leaving warframe and starting their own thing Oh, what is, what is this? It began a song, pitched sweet and solemn. It, it sounded like uh, it was gonna be, he specifically said part of DE's legacy. So I think he's staying in the fall. team. Oh. The children raised in Castle Loft. What the hell? Made hunters. Grave of others, not. Remember this. We are a family. Welcome back to In the fold, Tenno. The pale of Odin's sky. Live valiant fields of rain and wild, where omen beasts of Alka's lost. Remember still and tell the ghost. I thought they said no buts. I mean, I'm here for it, don't get me wrong, but.
That's cheating. And what is even going on? <laughs> no, this is not Warframe. This isn't Warframe. This is something totally different. This is a new IP. Looks cool though. This looks awesome. Dude, I'm seeing so many things in this that I like. Welcome back to the fold, Tenno. And soul frame? Oh my god, dude. Oh my god, bro. That's genius. <laughs> that is genius. Wow, dude. That is wild. That is so wild. Applause, please. Oh. Oh. Hold up. And the sight's down. Yeah, we'll have to do that later. Dude, that is that is cool. That is that is actually awesome. That looks that looks totally badass. I I really really dug that. It looked super artsy. Another game in the Frame series. Yeah, I, I don't know, man. It's a new game by Digital Extremes, it seems. Nice that they're branching out, but slightly sad to see some team some team members seem to be leaving. Well, it, it seems like they're keeping it under Digital Extremes umbrella, so they, you know, they'll still they'll still be there in spirit, I think. Yeah. That was super cool. That was that was really, really cool. Um Yeah, Epion, that was great, man. My lord. I never, I never would have expected Tenocon to be announcing a new game. That's, that's totally wild. That's totally wild. Uh, that was, that was really good. That was really good. Hmm. What is this music? That was great. I think, is it loading us back in our orbiter? I'm not sure what's going on here. Hey, Shazio, good to see you, bud. Inbox messages await the operator. Cool. Okay, so that was freaking Tenocon, and uh, that was great, man. Every year, this this show continues to be something fun and enjoyable to watch. Um, real quick, last time I'm going to plug this. First of all, of course, 
thank you to the devs for sponsoring the stream. Always happy to take a look at this. Um, as I've said the last multiple years we've done this, I would be watching this anyway. So it's it's I really appreciate that they reach out and continue to uh, to support the channel in the way that they do. So thanks thanks to DE, we really do appreciate it. Um, so on that note, uh, last thing I'm gonna tell you guys to do is this thing is awesome. If you go to co.tv slash Warframe, that'll take you right here to, oh, is it down? No, is it down? No. So it looks like it may be down. Um, there's a really cool computer giveaway that you can enter um, of, a, of a badass looking computer. And um, yeah, but, oh, it looks like everything crashed. Oh, it looks like it looks like everything is crashing. I think yeah, everything everything is unavailable. Oh my lord, look at that. Okay, well no wonder, especially after they dropped all that stuff. Um, it looks like we got a letter from. Oh, dude, from Rebecca. This is this is Space Mom. For over ten years, I've been writing posts to you. I've always called you Tenno. That will never change. Other things though are changing. We're in a new chapter of Warframe. I've always written from the perspective of someone who's been a steadfast believer in community as a core part of what makes Warframe great. And that belief will stay with me now that I get to work closer with the developers that have made everything possible. The community has always been the heart of Warframe. The developers have been the soul. It is an honor and an emotional one at that to be a part of Warframe's future in the creative director role. Oh, she actually is taking over directly from Steve. Even more of an honor being able to do it with members of our team growing into roles that form Warframe's new leadership. You know some of this team already and there are many new faces behind the scene. They're wonderful people who I deeply respect. And as we work through the transition, I know you'll feel the same. As for DET moving on to our incredible second project, Soul Frame, they've not gone far. I miss many of them in the Warframe dev stream couch, but I'm excited for the next generation of folks that will be blinded by our studio lights. I hope to make them proud and bother them frequently with my fashion frame choices. Nothing can stop me now. How lucky we are that both science fiction and fantasy will now exist under one roof. Envoys and Tenno, the future is bright. See you soon, DE Rebecca. How on DE's Discord, Soulframe is described as a free-to-play MMO. Oh, so they're not doing like the... They, they don't call Warframe an MMO. I don't believe. Do they call Warframe an MMO? It's not. I don't think, I don't, I don't think Warframe is an MMO. So that, that's interesting. Okay. It's an exciting time for Warframe as Rebecca Ford transitions to creative director while Steve Sinclair and others focus their efforts on a brand new game, Warframe. Oh, this is from Steve. Digital Extremes have been my home for the entire game development, my entire game development career, 20 plus years and counting. Over 10 of those years have been in Warframe, but in truth, the Warframe story started much earlier. Warframe once existed as Dark Sector in my mind in the early 2000s. Turning that seed of Dark Sector into Warframe has been a life-defining accomplishment for me and the DE team. I feel like I can say we did it. And in some ways, I thought it'd be the last thing we do as a team, but we want to tell another story. Soul Frame's development has officially just begun. We hope you follow along. It's only possible because the community believed in Warframe to allow me 10 beautiful years in the origin system. Further still, the Warframe team believed in me. More importantly, I believed in them. I know they can do great things with the story of Tenno, and now a group of us has set our sights on the fantasy genre to tell the story of Soul Frame. I want to have fantasy and science fiction as a part of DE's legacy. I want to spend as much time with Soul Frame as I have with Warframe. My beard only has so much black left in it. Envoys, see you in the future. We all live together as always, DE Steve. Oh man, damn, what an announcement. What a freaking announcement. They, they, that, that is, that is it's just wild, man. Absolutely wild. Wow. Can't wait to see gameplay. It looks super cool. I mean, we basically just saw like world building stuff today, but yeah, that looks, that looks super cool. Um, Damn. Dang. <laughs> yeah, those are both great announcements by them. I think that was great. That was really good. That was really good. I think I think the Warframe thing is still down. It totally is. It's totally still down. <laughs> I was I wanted to get one last one last push. So here here's the deal. I don't think it closes soon. So, um, yeah, make sure to hit code.tv slash Warframe and enter that up. Our code is co-carnage, by the way, if you do get in at some point and want those 15 extra uh, things there. So, 
I'm confused by the gameplay of De Deviri Paradox though. Okay, so real talk, it looks like Deviri Paradox is actually, it's almost like a single player roguelite in Warframe. Now it did show at one point that we were gonna be picking a Warframe, so maybe, or, or, or choosing a Warframe. So maybe at that point, it's gonna open up more into our, our kind of classic Warframe experience. But it it looks like they're they're going completely different with it. New uh, actual like single character, um, roguelite elements in terms of choosing your skills. They made they did specifically say that the skills were per session. So, I mean, is it going to be the kind of thing we're playing it over and over? It's going to give you different reward. Like so so many questions, um, lots and lots of questions, but. It looked awesome. That world looked fantastic. The events that were going on looked really cool. The main character seems pretty awesome. So what is the difference between a rogue light and a rogue like? Um, rogue light with a T means that elements are connecting the plays. Rogue like with a K means that you're basically restarting the game from scratch every single time you die. So the difference is if there's a meta progression or not. Um, do we, do we know if there's a meta progression in that one? We do, we do, because in, in that one, he was getting to a respawn point and activating it. And then when he died, he would then show up at that point. So we know that there's something carrying between something is moving forward as you continue to play the game. Um, so yeah, it, it, that whatever we saw, and I mean, we, we know very little about it, but whatever we saw would be much more of a rogue light than a rogue like. Um, a rogue like would be every single time he died, he popped right back up in that area. He was being executed and everything was exactly the same as when he died before. So it's, it's a little, I mean, it seems almost semantical is that a word it is now. It seems almost like semantics, how, how small the changes, but I mean, it completely changes the feel of the game. So, you know, it's, it's, it's good to, good to know the difference. Did I play the new war? Oh, hell yeah, dude. I, I, I did the sponsor stream for the new war and then <laughs> immediately logged in the next day and finished it. I, I, I loved it. I thought new war was super cool. I really enjoyed it. Um, it was very good. But anyway, guys, what I'm going to do now is I am going to go run and get some dinner. And then I think I'm going to jump back on maybe in like 30 minutes or an hour, maybe for some shiv two and whiskey. We'll see. Um, something like that. But yeah, it's been a, it's been a long day, but I'm, I'm not done with you yet. I don't think I'm done with you yet. So on that note, I want to give one final big shout out to our friends over at Digital Extremes. It is always a pleasure working with them. I, I really do thank them for, uh, for sponsoring the channel and, and having us be a part of this every time they do it. And we will continue to do that as, as Warframe is a game that I've always had fun playing. Uh, there's so much good stuff on the horizon um, between Soul Frame, uh, Devere Paradox. Uh, it's just It's just looks fantastic. So yeah, I really appreciate them having us be a part of this and uh, looking forward to hopefully continue being so in the future. Uh, my code is co-carnage, exactly like the Twitch name, co-carnage. So if you actually do, I, I'm still trying to pull it up here, but if you actually do get to code.tv slash Warframe and get to that PC giveaway, uh, my code is just like my Twitch name, co-carnage. It'll get you 15 extra entries. That computer looks badass. It is 100% one of a kind from the looks of it. And um yeah, pretty awesome. So for everyone that needs just a couple more minutes for the drops, I'm gonna run my outros. Uh, so you've got, you're gonna get like an extra six minutes. And um, yeah, we will definitely go from there. So you can also find that in the profile button. If the, if the link in my profile button works, that might be a good place to do it too. Let me, let me check that real quick. Maybe the link in my profile button works. Um, nope, that's not loading for me either. But hey, maybe you'll get in. All right, friendos. I will see you guys a little bit later. Thank you so much being here i hope you enjoyed the show today and i will see you in just a little bit for probably some just super chill shiv two for just a little bit all right see you guys later